Hey guys, and welcome to Guns 2. Uh, this game is a weird game, sort of like Titanfall. It's free to play, which is good, especially when you don't have enough money to buy Titanfall. Like some people I know. Okay, right, me right now. And this game is fun. It's a good free to play. For several reasons. One of these reasons being the fact that you can do crazy moves, which I will hopefully show throughout this. Basically, what this is, is Devil May Cry meets... Devil May Cry meets... Um, multiplayer. There we go. Well, it's hard when you try to concentrate in fighting. Basically, what this is, is you have free guns with each hero. And my hero is sort of like a sniper, he's got a sniper rifle, submachine gun, everyone has like a submachine gun, and a melee weapon, just a sword. Chapter Spear Long, Blade Katana. Now, what the plan of this game is, this is only the campaign of it, there's actually another multiplayer element here, which I will show off after I beat this first campaign level. Really show off its first campaign level to a point that I feel it's been need to be show off to. But right now, we're just going to run through. There is basic combo, so it's your knockdown combo, which is also like a power attack, and your light basic attacks. You can also do headshots, like so, boom. Which are pretty sweet. And they give you like, bonus damage, which is great. Like, AI in this is super glitchy, and it's very fickle on the aiming. There is Ed Dodges, which is great. When you knock a guy down on the ground, you have to shoot them because you can't hit them with your weapon, which is really lame. But that's how it is. You can also do wall runs like so. You can then wall run up like so. And you can jump off. All while doing air dodges, of course and swap your weapons. And the best way to play this game is a mixture of aggressive and not aggressive. So like any action RPG, I mean action... What do they call it? Action platformers, I think? I don't know. But remember, when you're on the ground, shoot them with the gun, because you can't hit them any other way. So it's always good to keep some ammo in your guns. Headshot. Ooh, headshot. Now you may notice that I'm glowing with feverish passion right now. Oops. Oops. There we go. Um, it allows me to use a special move. If I come into contact with enemies, so I've got two special moves. One is like a kick, which is like that. And the other is a Q, which you only get once you get supercharged, and it's like this. Pushing. Of course, I missed the enemy. If I did, I would have got the glowing blade like I did before. There are things that quickly upgrade those things. They give you bonus heat. Grab the thing. Don't need to reload. That's all good. Boom, throw that. Oh, I died. Now I use a coin to revive myself. And I'm not sure coins I have, but you get them back for after this day. Just trying to get off the top here. Over here. 
Headshot. Ooh. Right now I'm playing the campaign. Like I said before, there are two types. It's the campaign and it's actual playing the game. Which is just a multiplayer battle of 4v4. It's nowhere... It's not that great because it's really laggy a lot of the times. So and there are people who have much better weapons than you because of free to play mechanisms. Oh jeez, they are everywhere on me. <laughs> You can see up the middle of the screen where it says coins, that's how many coins I have left. Headshot. Oh, I got my Fury move again. I'll show you against this boss. Ow, ow. Okay, I just died. I'm like not done yet. <laughs> Whoopsie daisy. I'm not too worried about wasting all these coins because yeah, I'm not going to use them anywhere else, so I might as well. Now there are four different classes, I'm only going to show off one of them because you have to have gold and stuff to unlock the other ones. Nice. Which I don't have. Get to the rally point. Now we're going to the second part of this first mission, which I don't believe we're going to go that far because there's only two of us and we're meant to have four people. And I seem to be playing quite terribly, which isn't that surprising considering it's me, but at least I'd like to not play terribly. Make sure my guns are reloaded. And now we head forward. The One of my big pet feeds is our minimap. Because no matter which direction I'm in, they al it always seems to be not facing where you want to face or where you wish it faced. I'm definitely getting some lag here, making it a lot harder to do a lot of this stuff. But neither say it's not all the lag's fault. It's got a lot to do with me too. Okay, I'm out of coins now. That's fine. If I press F5, it goes not enough for rival coins. But anyway, that's enough of this, so... Oh. Well, I guess I'll just wait for this guy to die. He shouldn't have too many more coins, and considering I have no more coins, he's probably going to stop. He's beating me in school though, which is admirable, I guess. I don't know. We went that far behind each other. It's just more he was the host, so he wasn't getting weird lag spikes like I was. Just making it hard to do any fights. I'm not entirely sure what he's doing right now. We can just literally go around. There we go. He is playing as a weird little double daggered girl, which is alright, but it's not the strongest character. Well, I don't know. It's definitely more themed around attacks instead of range attacks, like my guy's more around long range attacks. I have no idea where she's, what she's doing and where she's going. I assume she's probably just trolling me until I leave, maybe? Who knows. There we go, she's moving on now. Hopefully she dies soon and gives up on this. If not, we're going to be here a long time watching her. Which I guess could be fun. This came out in January of this year. So it's a fairly new game. It could definitely use some more support, so if you guys are watching this video and you actually like how this looks, feel free to check it out on Steam. It's free to play, which is good. I've already said that before. It's not exactly like Titanfall, but if you don't have the money for Titanfall, like a lot of people, aka me and several other people, well, you do have the money, you just want to spend it in a better form. Okay, not spending eight dollars on Titanfall. And what she's doing here is basically trying to lure the enemies so they come in one by one very slowly, much like you would with Dark Souls. You would slowly lure enemies. She definitely seems to have more melee combos than my character did, although she could just be a very high level compared to me because I'm only level two. So I only really had two moves, which was my special moves and that little parry that I did by clicking both left and right mouse button at the same time. 
This is incredibly frustrating to watch, I'm not gonna lie. Because it's so boring. It wouldn't nearly be as bad if there was more people. Mainly because you can kind of share the damage out a bit more, switch up the front line, switch up the back line sort of thing. She does seem to be doing a very good job, but again, that's because she wasn't lagging, so she didn't have to go, oh my god, they're glitching all around the place, why can't I shoot them? Sort of thing. She's on 55 HP. I doubt she's gonna die here, but when it comes to bosses that come up later in this area, she probably will. But she's gonna be fine for a while because she can just literally spend forever shooting them one by one, one by one, and one by one. Which I guess good on her if she wants to spend this long playing this game. I certainly wouldn't want to play the campaign for this long. I would much rather just move on as fast as possible. And as far as I get, as far as I get. And as you can see, she's luring the people out. She's using her launcher and hitting people in the air. She's about to die right now. Oh no, she just escaped in time. 5 HP. All it takes is one lucky bullet to hit her, and she is dead. Chances of that happening very low because the range guys never seem to really hit you. They'll hit you maybe once if they're lucky, but they're generally not that good. And. To be fair, it's quite hard to hit people with ranged weapons in this game. Not as hard as you would think, but it's harder than you hoped. There is some plot in this game. I never really paid that much attention to it when I was playing the campaign. I haven't been the campaign completely yet, as you can tell, I'm not very good at the game. And this is more of a quick let's look. Kind of hoping this game would. This campaign may be over a little bit faster. I'm gonna have to watch one person literally just take on the entire army by herself because the other person doesn't have any more revive coins. I was also hoping for more revive coins, but meh. It's just the way it is, I guess. And there you go, she was using a special ability there. I don't actually know what a special ability does, but I'm assuming it makes her go faster and attack harder. She is very low in HP still. She can still very easily die to just one random hit. And I'm guessing what she's more doing is hoping that she doesn't get spawned from behind and get wrecked. Well, one of these guys will land at least one shot at one point. Look at how bad these guys aim up. It's dreadful. It also looks like she has some sort of stealth move, so she can like avoid attacks, like the hit, yeah, the hit collision and make the stuff. Which is absolutely, absolutely gay when you think about it. There's also no fall damage, I should probably say that from the start. Not that it's important though. And basically what this game is like, oh she's on very low HP, 3 HP and 2 armor. I'm gonna cut this bit out here. I'll be back once this round's over. Oh, she died. I think that was her last coin too. Yay! Oh no, she decided to respawn. What else? And this really isn't much point doing the campaign unless you have more than two people. Four people would be preferable. The player four with four people before, one random and two friends. It was alright. And, like ridiculous thing possible to play. You could actually take hits without being such a big worry. And you can play well, so it's a good And she died again. 
And she's never cut. Good on her. And as you can see at the top, that's the choice how many enemies are left before you can continue. I was going to say something bad about the minimap. And I already did, but I didn't say a lot. I'll probably talk about that more in the next part. Because this part's still being cut out. Alright, we're back. Um, we lost that other match, of campaign match thing of course, but now we're playing a multiplayer match. Uh, as you can see, we have several guys here. Um, I do not have control over my character. Alright, there we go, we got control over my character again. Uh, I'll cut out that scene uh, where I ult out for a second, ult out back in. Alright, here we go. Uh, okay, we got a guy over here. myself a kill. Oh, that guy literally just spawned there. And she's got a really high level gun, I'm guessing. I'm not entirely sure if she does or not. She may or may not. I'm not well versed in how this game works. I actually like this map, it's nice and big compared to other maps in this game. Yeah. Now remember, when you're running around, you really want to hold down your shift button. Fire bitch. If you can, though. What? He even hit me then. Uh. Okay, she's dead. Oh, there's no one up here. Okay, apparently I'm dead. What well, else? <laughs> this game is ridiculous in how you can just die in two hits or not. They still do have the heat moves in this sort of thing, so you can get the bonus damage and whatnot. Okay, apparently that's as high as I can run up on that thing. Yeah, that's the end of the level. Maps are incredibly confusing. I have no idea what any of that means. But I'm sure it's important. Oh, there's an enemy. Let me get out of here. Oh, why the hell does she just wreck us so easy? What else? I am even caring. As you can see, this is fairly intense. I wish my other guy was helping me out even slightly there, but oh well. That guy is fairly high level. Oh, I've got my heat move going. So if I can find someone, I'll hopefully hit them with it and then get the bonus damage on my blade. Hopefully. I have no guarantees in this because I haven't even seen anyone yet. In ages. Oh, 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 I just have to use it. Nope. Sister, which is lame. Oh, I so shot that guy first. Oh, he's being a bit of a bitch though. Just staying back there using his sniper rifle. Uh, don't like those sorts of players. Never did, never will. So therefore I shall join them. Yeah. 
Oh my god. Seriously, that guy? <laughs> oh well. Wish my gun was as strong as his gun, though. He seems to do three quarter damage, whereas I don't do half. Oh, whoops, I'm not. Okay, that was weird. I jumped, dodged, and go. I'm guessing he must be host. Should say. Alright. Killing machine. No. Oh no, he's got a kill speed, okay. Yeah. Okay, apparently won't let me do my move at all. Gotta update this game sometimes. Oh. Just a oh. mm, got him. God oh, damn it. this game. Ah, <laughs> uh, this took I think, 10 years to get this remake. Where'd that guy go? Oh, oh he's behind me. He's just being a huge pussy. And I think someone cares me there. Oh well. Oh. Thank you, guy. Saved my life there. That seems so. Not friendly in the melee combat range. Kidding me that? Oh, he double kidding me there. I got studded so I couldn't attack that guy. Yeah. Oh, that's as short as fun though. Seven minutes left or 50 points for both teams. Are you kidding me? That guy isn't dead yet? He's just shooting at me. He should be dead. Yeah. Oh, the enemy team won. Oh well, that was a fun game and that's the end of this. Let's look at it. Uh, as you can see, I leveled up. Hooray! Got some money, got some ore, got a new attack called Rising Attack, which is good. And I didn't get that good of a score. <laughs> we all got this made by this guy though, but that was because he was really high level and had played the game. Look, look, he's level 12 and everyone else is level 5. Oh, these guys are level 13 and 11. What's wrong with them? I went there apparently. Well, they sort of were, but not enough compared to them. Oh well. And this has been Guns with a Z. The second arc. Pretty good game. See you later, guys.